I don't know how good y'all can see this, but there are two babies on that table right there. There's a Miss Blythe outcast, and it's looking pretty shiny. It ain't gonna last. Okay, let me back up. I will put a grumpy old man to sit down if he don't trip getting there. And there's two new armored cars or trucks, whatever you want to call them. There's Sarah's Outcast, looking brand new, never been run. And there's my mini Creighton, and I'm gonna get it all dirty today. I don't want to, but I will. Somebody's got to do it sometime, and it might as well be me. Anyhow, grass needs mowing. Been wet around here, and uh, cones is that yeah, ain't important. But okay. All right, let's get it done. I run it on 3S instead of 4S just because I can. I want to tell you right now. Oh, damn, running in the building already. There goes Miss Bly on her outcast. I don't know how this is working on it. I got a hat camera on, or a camera hat on, or whatever you want to call it. And, uh, crap, I forgot to zoom. Now, is it on or not? Back and I don't zoom. know. No. Let me look. You record, baby. Huh? You are recording. Okay, well. This driving old man is crazy. Go on, I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna say something silly. Y'all see some smoke? I didn't call. Mm. I set the world on fire because I'm vaping. I really like the way that body looks and all that stuff on there. I ain't made up my mind about these radios yet. Since I probably won't never be using the 50, 75, and 100% settings on it because I don't see the need for that for my purposes, then I don't know that I will ever use them. And if that's what's been causing the problems, that and the cheesy wheel, I've got the wheel problem maybe solved. I bought some half inch weather stripping with sticky tape on one side, sticky stuff on one side. And uh, I think I'm gonna put some of that on there and see how that goes. I just didn't have time yet. Whew. It's been a hard few days on a junkie old man, a grumpy old man, a junkie old man too. It was, we had, we throwed a party Friday night. And it was all kinds of drinking and carousing and carrying on and, well, I think I drank too much prune juice and Metamucil. It just finally hit me and that, that wasn't a pretty sight. You, you didn't want no video camera in there when I was, I was getting rid of all that stuff. So we just, we just, <laughs> she's over laughing there. We, I said it wasn't funny. And, sh and we just, you know, ain't had time. I ain't felt like doing it until this afternoon. I'm t tumble uh -oh. rumble. So let me uh -oh. let me see if I can turn this off now with this button right here. Maybe I can get a little running in. If things a little lively. It's got the stock wheels on it, which I've, I've never had no use for them mini monkey tires, whatever the hell they are. I ain't never monkey grip tires. What do they call them things? But I've never had no use for them. I know some of y'all like them, and some of y'all don't. Man, that thing's a whoop it around. It's a, it's a whole different experience driving this and the success. I mean, this thing is lighter on its feet. It's more agile. It's just, it's just quick. And so I'm going to get away from you in a heartbeat. I think I got the trim. It was a moving a little bit to the right. 
for a while. Move a little bit more to the left. And uh, see how it goes. All right, now I'm going back and watch Miss Bly for a few minutes. I done told her she better be careful and don't rip that wing off that sucker. I said, yeah, it's going to turn over too, ain't it? Oh, shoot. All right, I go back to doing serious stuff now here. And this is just 3S. There are Power Hobbies, uh, 3S. Ah, damn, it sounded loud. Okay. And they are 7600 milliamp, uh, 75C, 150C burst. And they, they do a, oh, crap. Oh, well. When it gets up like that on the two wheels, slam the damn juice to it and see what happens. Sometimes it keeps from turning over. No, you stopped. You just didn't do nothing and it done that. And that one might right, self right itself. Yeah, I think, I think we're gonna need to tighten the silver clutch up. Anybody know how to do that? <laughs> Read the book, that's what I always tell everybody. Ready? I'm, I'm waiting on you. Yeah, the clipper clutch, and he's tightening. And these people are not wanting to see me drive, they want to see you drive. They want to see you run over this table. This is a new table, this thing's bigger. <laughs> if she wrecks into that. this thing, she's going to do some damage to something on her truck. Don't slam on the brakes in a curve. Whew. Thought she was going to have to do some more walking there for a minute. <laughs> Quit that laughing. You sound like a goofball. <laughs> At least I can drive. That's debatable. What? Yeah, right. I can drive all right. I can drive right into that daggone cone and it can't get off of it. Oh, I did, didn't I? Yeah, barely. Let me get out here. Let me get in the wall in there. Yeah, you get out there and wreck somebody. I'm going to try Hit the to. building. Hit the building. <laughs> Oh, Lord have mercy. Tumbler, rumbler, but it come out. The cone. <laughs> that cone's gonna catch a fit. Call 911, it's a cone alert. All right, I don't know what I'm doing. Well, I know that. I'm pretty sure that if I had some good tires on here like that Richard Duper Bash does, I could do some wheel stands. Don't run into me. This takes a whole lot of different. This is a whole different steering than the big ones. <laughs> Wait, a minute. Wait a minute. Don't quit running over to me, you goof. <laughs> what you doing? Wait a minute. Not a damage my car. I, don't you do it again? I'm gonna turn your back right side up. Maybe. No, nope, not like that. I ain't. Look, you're gonna be a dumpy old man if you don't quit doing that. Get off of me! Let me see it, sorry. Let me see if I can do what them big boys do. Better not break it. Well, I was doing that. I don't know how they do that. Insanity. Keep trying to do the same thing over and over again with the same results. I married you, Dana. That yeah. was insanity. They proved it right off the bat. 
All right, you gonna go turn your car over or not? Maybe I need some stabilizer bars like you have on race cars. Yeah, I don't think I see no stabilizer bars on this one. The other two do. Maybe you need to cut your Oops. throttle back into kitty mode. Kitty my ass. All right, I got the recorder going. Well, record that, dude. <laughs> if you give it to me a finger. No, I did not this time. Okay. Tumbly rumbly. <laughs> Damn, I, wish, I wish I had a subscribe button. If you want for my roll bar on my truck, I'd be driving a convertible. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that thing, I wasn't, I wasn't expecting it to last five minutes, but it's tougher than it looks. Dude, that thing is the bomb. We're going to put some lights on it. Oh, no, they won't so last. I can see when it falls off. Them things won't last. I tell you, people. If I had, if this had come out two, I don't know how long we've had them 6S jobber dudes, but if these things had been out when the, when we bought our 6S, I'm not sure I'd have bought a 6S. Now, this, I know this is just the first outing and all, but I am totally impressed. I can't do all these fancy stuff like Richard. Oh, you missed it. I turned mine around at going full speed. Well, I can't watch both of I can't do all this stuff like Richie does and... Uh, RC Dude 81, I got that guy's name right, and uh, Bickety Slickety Bam Slam, I can't get him, I just, I can't do that stuff, and uh, two or three more of my time, I can't remember who you are, I'm old, and I'm not too grumpy right now, but I've been grumpy this weekend, he sure has. and I just, I just wonder, I ain't got knots on my head, because this woman, I went a little rough on her because she's dumb and a rock and she won't pay attention to nothing I tell her. Ooh, that looked pretty good. But uh, she loves me and I love her back and that's just the way it is. I think we both need to get rock crawlers and put one big old rock right in the middle of the yard out there and just crawl around on that rock. I would have to. I'd have donations to, are appreciated. I would have to have a big slab of flat cement to even crawl a rock crawl on it. <sighs> Well, we're having fun, and that's all that matters to us. I don't know what matters to y'all. I didn't do this for making any money on YouTube was the furthest thing from my mind when I done this channel. I had some people that are not in the RCs, and, and I know them, but they, I talked to them, I got a ham radio license, and we talk about everything, and I irritate them when I got some of them, they did they don't like it when I talk about my guns. They don't like it when I talk about my RC, but some of them do. And they talk about stupid stuff, and we all listen to them, so they have to listen, you know, five minutes here or there. And so I was telling about the RC, and somebody said, right, let me see what you got and everything. So I, I tried to upload a video to the Arma form, and they wouldn't let me. And I understand that now. They just don't want you to do that. They want you to put a link to YouTube, and that's just as good, except I didn't have no YouTube account. Now I do. And uh, it's, it's right much fun. I don't have a computer well enough to edit uh, videos on. It's, it's too darn slow. <laughs> it, it, he missed it, you missed it. Well, you should have your camera running, and oh, uh, but oh. And quit interrupting me. I'm trying to tell these people stuff. Roll back over. Anyhow, my computer does fine except for compiling the uh, video. It, it's too slow. I can't watch the playback on the in the uh, editor program. It it it, 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 it just it, it, it. so I gotta get a faster computer. So rumbly tumbly, rumbly dumbly. Sarah, if you don't shut up, I'm gonna rumbly tumbly you. Miss Bly, let me have some money, so I'm gonna try to order me a new computer. I don't know what I need. But I know what I don't want. I don't want a bunch of junk I don't need. That's what I don't want. My my computer is old. It's a it's a Dell. Uh, what is that thing? A 600s or something like that. As I inspire on, and it's a good computer. It it does everything I want to do. It always has, except it will not work good. It video editing. I don't know what it needs a faster processor for that. 
or whether it needs uh, more RAM. I just ain't sure, but I got it maxed out on RAM and it still ain't quite enough. But I'm gonna get another. All right, I'm gonna hush and you done turn it. I'm down again. Oh, Lord, baby. <laughs> And there she goes again. I don't even know what I was talking about a while ago. I don't guess it's important. I'm just making little short things. That I'm going to piece some of them together. Ooh, I better move my truck. That thing is not in a good spot with her driving. You want to talk? You ran over me. Whoops. Whee. Well, baby. I, I told you that stuff. That slipper clutch is wearing in a little bit and getting about a bite. And it might be Dean's grass is a little uh, drier in ours too. I can't hardly get a wheelie out of mine because them darn mucky tires on there. Well, you can't drive. Well, I, anybody can go wheel stand, you just nail the throttle. And anybody can be dumb and wrecked like that too. <laughs> deal y'all while she's gone and she don't have to listen to this again. In 1997 I done something stupid and it was something that I had been doing before I was working on an amateur radio antenna tower and it wasn't nothing wrong but the way I approached it this time was really stupid and uh, I injured my back badly and after two failed attempts to fix it I was crippled. And I got back over where I could walk again, but I am in constant pain. And one reason I sound like I'm getting got a lick of sense sometimes is because I live day to day in so much pain, you wouldn't believe it. I know there's people out there have more pain than I do. And I feel sorry for them if they do. And I've got happy pills, and that, they gone it. You gonna Rumbly get that? bumbly upside down. <laughs> Are you gonna go get that, or am I gonna have to? I get it. And, uh, I take happy pills, sometimes they work, sometimes they don't, and they make me grumpy, and they make me stupid at times, and I can use that word because I can call myself stupid, but that's, that's my life, up and down, up and down, up and down. I'm never without pain, I can't go to sleep without pain, get up in the morning with pain, don't want no sympathy, don't want it at all, just want you to enjoy what I'm doing, and I hope you do because I really enjoy everybody that their RC and other kind of uh, videos they put on YouTube. I just, I enjoy it. I turned into a YouTube junkie and I really like it. I live vicariously. I named a few of y'all a while ago. Some of the best drivers I've ever seen. That's Stephen, Stephen, I don't know how you pronounce that. I, I, it's foreign to me. Is Stephen, or I'd call him Stefan, or but whatever it is, Z. Stefan. Stefan, that's what it is. Stefan Z. Stefan Z. That's a good name. Anyhow, I, I really think he is one of the best at what he does, if not the best. I have never seen anything like him in my life. He is just awesome. And I live vicariously through him and so the rest of y'all, Duper Bash and uh, Notorious J. And Biggity Bam, see I know who you are, I'm just messing with you all ago. Biggity Bam, and uh, I, I like Kevin Talbot, I, I can watch him. He's probably the one that got me really back interested in this stuff again. And uh, him and Pat, I think their friendship is one of the best things I've ever seen. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> I don't know what she's laughing at. I'm going backwards down the field, dummy. Okay. But uh, I think it's a good thing to have friends like that. I don't have any. I used to have any. I used to have any. I used to have a lot until I got to where I didn't have no money no more and I couldn't contribute as much, you know, to the funny, fun stuff as everybody else was doing. And when you run out of money, sometimes you'll run out of friends. So they weren't really friends to start with. And I don't have any people that I know that... Will you quit interrupting me? God dad, go! I don't know why I put up with this woman, and she gets right between me and my car, and I can't tell where I'm at. And I'm trying to talk to y'all, make some sense, and that ain't gonna be easy. Anyhow, I got no friends that's interested in this other than watching me do it and have fun. So that's the reason I started the YouTube channel, was so I could just, you know, you can't mail a darn video file this big. So uh, 
I'll start a channel so I can send them a link to it and t tell them how to subscribe. Give me a thumbs up and ring the freaking bell, but they too dumb sometimes to even do that. So I still have to send some links to them. Ain't nobody told me to quit yet, but uh, they have fun. They all oh, crap. Look at that. Yeah, I know it. I'll no get, driving. I'll get the driving. damn thing this time, woman, if I can get over there. Ah. Uh, Crap, I need to turn the darn thing off, didn't I? This, I'm gonna walk over there, and I'm recording, and if I fall down, y'all can laugh. This hat is a bomb, but it's a little heavy. It wants to shake around on here. If I bend over without holding on to it, it'll fall off, I guarantee it. So I gotta hold it on like that. Uh, I hear fans running, so it can't be too bad a shake. All right, let me get back over here. <laughs> Tibber, Tibber Vaughn, he, he, him, he's got a, a YouTube channel, him and his Northwest crew over somewhere in England, I think that's where they're at. And they've got a bunch of, I thought they're youngins, but they ain't. They're older, they're not as old as I am. Ain't nobody as old as I am. But they're, they're friends and they have a ball and I wish to God I could go over there and spend a week or two with them and, and let them, you know, entertain me and me entertain them. But it won't never be able to happy, happen. But they do rock crawling, they play on the beach, they do a whole lot of stuff. And uh, I can't do no rock crawling. <laughs> if I, you see me rock crawling, I'd be down on my hands and knees trying to crawl to get out of the darn rock. I don't remember who it was, it sounded like I sound like Morgan Freeman. Well, I guess that's all right. It's better than I, me sounding like Morgan Fairchild. I wouldn't mind looking like Morgan Fairchild. I could, I would stay at home every day. I'd probably give up RC and if I look like Morgan Fairchild. I keep Sarah around just for other things. I really do like these trucks. These are 3S now, I'm telling you, 3S. I'm, we ain't doing nothing on 4S yet. I wasn't even sure what 3S was going to do. And honest to God, I'm with JTRC on this for people that are not doing just totally whacked out ooh. <laughs> so you can run in the building on 3S just as darn easy as you can on 4S. Now, don't do near as much damage. But people that aren't trying to jump to the moon and do back flips and forward flips and I wish I could do that stuff but I just I don't know y'all make me so nervous doing that I, I can't stand it I'll just wait for it to break and I don't like to see things break I'm one of the kind of guys I do watch NASCAR I'm gonna lie about it to see who wrecks I don't want nobody to get hurt but I want every one of them to hit the damn wall I just I mean I don't care just every now and then you need to hit the wall and uh, that's just my attitude don't get hurt doing it but hit the wall and I hate to see anybody tear a truck up, but I'd, I'd like for you to hit the darn wall once in a while. Nose dive, that thing. And uh, uh, I just, I don't know, I enjoy watching them. I, Kevin takes it, Kevin Talbot, he takes it to a whole different level. And he just hurts my feelings sometimes where he treats his cars. But he's right, they're just toys. They're, and they just, you can't take them too serious. I mean, you need to be serious about your hobbies, but they're just toys and you, you're supposed to have fun with it. And if sending them to the moon or, or going to try to see how many backflips you can do knowing you're going to hit the ground and they're screwed up this position you can, it just, uh, you know, if that's what makes you happy, that's what makes you happy. It don't, that don't make me happy. I would love to do the backflips and all that stuff, but I don't want to, I don't want to tear everything up. But my trigger finger is not good enough to do that anymore, I don't think. I may build a ramp or two and let Miss Bly try it, and uh, I can sit back and laugh at her because she'll be buying the parts I ain't going to. She's bought most of this stuff as it is. She's bought the biggest stuff. I bought a right smart of the little stuff you need, tools and and other things, and uh, it's, you know, because this ain't my first rodeo. I've been, I've been doing this off and on since 19, uh, I, Gave me something, I think, flying model airplanes. I flew model airplanes for years. And I've been, this is my third time in the RC cars, trucks, whatever. And this is Sarah's 
second time in RC Call. So she's not a total rookie, although if she don't drive for three or four days, you have to train her again. Uh, she's one of these people, if, you, if she works for you and she takes a break, you got to retrain her before she can go back to work. But she's, just where she's better at driving, I, things whoop up. I believe the shocks need to be just a little bit stiffened on these things. Maybe not, but I believe they do in some thicker shock oil. Mm. Maybe that thing will wheel it. Yes, indeedy. And it ain't heavy. I can pick that thing up and walk around with it. Them M6S uh, armors are, they're pretty darn heavy. And when I wreck one of them, if I got to tote it somewhere, I ain't looking forward to that at all. I've seen how they do it. I was watching something the other day, and I don't know why it didn't cross my mind. I'm going to get me a carabiner with some rope on it. And if I can turn the darn thing right side up, but if I have to carry it, I ain't going to carry it. I'm going to clamp a carabiner on the front bumper and uh, pull that thing, and that, that'll be what I'm doing. Oh, I'll give you all a tip. Let me, let me get this thing over here. I don't know how close I, I have to get it so I can see it. You see these things right here? Y'all have such a hard time with them. And uh, all you do is you take them and clamp them in a vise. And I ain't gonna pull that thing out because I can't hardly reach it as it is. But you clamp them in a vise right below the, uh, the circle right there. Clamp them in a the vise, whop them with a hammer till you get a bend in them. Then you got a bend you can pull the wing against. They ain't flat, you got a bend. And on the ones that run this way instead of this way, this is a good idea right here, but the ones that run back and forth like this, put the darn things in from this side instead of this side. Run into a tree when they're on this side, nothing happens. Run into a tree when they're on this side, they fly out. Y'all quit putting them things in there wrong. I used to race on a dirt clay track in a building. I don't remember how big that track was. It wasn't very big. Run an RC-10 pan car. Had cinder block walls. And I got introduced to them cinder block walls very, very often. I know a lot about body pins. If you put them in there the right way, they won't come out. If you put them in there the wrong way, they'll stay out. They won't do nothing. And as far as ripping the hole, I see everybody talking about ripping the hole. Get you some Gorilla Tape, duct tape, Gorilla Tape. That's the best stuff in the world. Get that double thick kind. Put it, if you don't put it nowhere else to keep your body from bending, put it over the darn hole and then cut the holes out. And, it, and you won't tear that stuff. If you do, you just put another layer on there. I ain't never seen one tear though. Gorilla tape is good. And Gorilla double-sided sticky tape is better than anything I ever seen. Oh man, I'm glad you the one's gonna sit them cones up. Well, run over that and take, why don't you? Yeah, that's right. If you got a reverse, it did go out. Okay. Have you tried switching it to uh, any lower settings on the throttle to see how it felt? Uh, no. Okay. Are you going to? Uh, no. Okay. Well, that's fine. I don't care. See, I'm seeing no purpose for the switch except it saves you from having to buy batteries because 50, 75, and 100. 100 would be a 4S battery. battery. 75 would be a 3S battery. And 50 would be a 2S battery. Neck too good. That's the same way to get the same I, result. Like I said, oh, I can't can't all right. <laughs> and then you do something <laughs> dumb. Oh, crap. <laughs> Kill me. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm going to pause this thing for a minute. Crap. I thought I was going to. I got some tires over there, I'll be here tomorrow. Some tower, like the ones that's on the outcast. I'm gonna see if they'll do any better. I got some of them little uh, Badlands, like Duper Bash has got on one of his little cars. I think it's maybe the top one or something. But the 2.8 with Badlands on them, they look a little small on this thing. I, I'm gonna try them too to see how they go. But I am perfectly satisfied for my personal use with the gearing 
and I'm not having a whole lot of trouble with this radio like I thought I was, you know, I didn't think I was going to like it. It doesn't feel good. It needs some phone. I got the phone to put on, on the steering wheel, and... They are touchy. Come to rumbly. This is my camera hat. Uh, I bought off Amazon. You can clamp your phone right there in that thing and then adjust it to where you want to. If this video does all right, then I'm going to give this camera hat a big round of applause because that's what I was using the whole time until right now because I've got it in my hand. You can change the mount to uh, a different, you know, different thing. You, just, you don't have to just use your phone. It comes with a mount for, I guess it's any standard GoPro accessory mount that would work on it because I've got a, uh, a Kazo uh, action camera and it works on it too. So I'm thinking this thing is good. It's a little heavy on your head and you probably look like a dummy wearing it, but I look like a dummy most of my life. So I ain't gonna worry about it too much. Thank you.